What's going on YouTube? What's going on Patreon friends? How's everyone doing today? What's going on on the angels that's gonna show up and check this out? I'm excited man. This is this is good timing. I just I just got back from a little uh, It was my birthday on Thursday. So my girlfriend took me out of town She took me to the mountains for a little while and we got to hang out with our friend Emily to hang out at some of the local clubs and stuff and uh, out in the town's called Fernie British Columbia if anyone wants to look it up It was just beautiful. It was such a good time I just like I had a smile on my face the whole entire time. It was just it was such such a blessing I just I, I can't express my appreciation for that But um, I did see that Angelina Jordan put out a new uh, a new cover today I got the notifications I got some great comments and I got a request from my friend mark on patreon and this works out man because I got uh, I got the next uh, the next four or five days planned out of just basically patreon requests I got some soulful Sunday stuff to do today. I got some Miley stuff tomorrow for um, the regular Milky Monday stuff and the rest of all Patreon. I'm looking I'm looking forward to it, man. There's some good stuff on this list. So uh, so a shout out to my friend Mark, uh, one of one of many on Patreon. <laughs> you can check me out there on, if you want. The link's in the description box. You can like and subscribe here as well. Um, I do get into uh, some of the kind of technical nuances, especially in like the live stuff, a little bit of the recording. I do like vocals and instruments and stuff, but uh, mostly mostly live production stuff. So if uh, if, uh, if, if y'all don't want me pausing too much, I'm going to be pausing. But it, it is what it is. It comes with the copyright territory and everything. But anyway, 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 I'm looking forward to this one, man. Like I say, after a little hiatus here, this is going to be a fun way to come back. Um, I've got all Angelina Jordan's links, um, her covers. I've got her originals. I've got everything in the description box as well. Please make sure that you've double-checked everything. You're not missing anything, any of the content coming out. Uh, what else? Let's go. Let's go. Let me make sure y'all can see this. man great introduction and like what I want to what I'm really excited about is and I, I talked about this lots so I'm just finding better language for it I think that Angelina Jordan manages the space in between her singing just as well as she manages her singing and what I mean by that is she has a lot of different like textures and a lot of different kind of like nuances that she mixes in pre-singing and post-singing sometimes even if it's just like a kind of a lead up and her breath and everything is just so it's so captivating like I'm just she's keeping me here on the edge of my seat plus there's like you know, reverbs and sounds and stuff like that that are kind of adding to that. But it's just, it, it, it's such a cast painting. And this buildup and then this like dead silence before her voice just kind of like pours in is so dramatic. And that alone, that alone, like is uh, for me would be reason enough to do this song. Just how she handled the space leading up to <laughs> and then all the space in, in between. But like it just, it makes it so dramatic. I want to see if I can find it again. And we actually get like the dead stop too. So you get like that long reverb. And you actually get the full audible stop where like everything is off and then she brings it in, right? It's just like, it's so, it's just like for the story and for Angelina, like other singers probably couldn't, like could probably do the same thing. I just don't think it would do what it just did to me in this moment. Look, 
very much further I don't wanna have to go Where you don't follow I won't hold it back again This passion inside I can't run from myself There's no way to hide but Sounds fantastic, man. She sounds fantastic. There was like a... There was a change, and I'm not going to say, like, for better or for worse, I'm not going to say it was, like, a production or recording mistake. There was a change, though, and I want to, I'm, I'm curious if I can kind of put together what I think it might be. I don't really need to love it was right there. It was you right there. And everything that you do. I don't really need to look very much further. I don't want to have to go where you don't follow. I won't hold it back again. This passion inside, I can't run from myself. There's no way to hide. I think what I think all I'm hearing is I think I'm just hearing two different takes. Like, because it's a recording, right? I think I'm just hearing two different takes. And it sounds like maybe she just like had more breath. Or maybe she stepped to a different position on the microphone, but like I'm not, I'm not, it's not a pitch, it's not a timbre, it's just like it's just like a presence thing that kind of changes. And it, I, and because I'm talk, I'm wearing headphones, I'm not gonna start guessing at what I think happened from a frequency standpoint, just because like the headphones are gonna have limitations. Um, but that's all I think it was. I, I, I don't. I don't I don't want to get too into it because I don't I don't think there's anything more than it was just like, you know, you're singing, you're, you're doing a take, you're getting into it, you know, you piece together the first part, the quiet part, and then we readjust for a little bit more volume now. I think that's all I'm hearing. There's no way to hide, but don't make me collapse from a Nice. I don't want to hurt anymore. Stay in my arms if you dare. Just thinking to myself, that last note is gonna be like, whew, it's gonna just be like, ooh, because it, it's like it's strong, strong, and then the gentle, and it just goes like right back into like Angelina Jordan's space, where it's just like, like there's so much control over all the things happening in her vocal, right? I'm gonna, I, I want to talk more about what she's doing singing too, but I'm just, I'm just captivated. Away right from me. Head voice does have a lot of Whitney, uh, uh, in my opinion. Like, it, and it's cool to hear her going in like a strong mix, like where she's getting, like so. So for me, for me, like head voice is like when you get in, like if I was singing along with this, it'd be like not nothing, nothing. Like that'd be like my head voice. It is what it is, right? For falsetto, it'd be like. I'm not gonna hit a note right now because it's gonna be weird. But anyway, like if you have like a lot more power before, behind it, so when she gets like this, there's nothing, nothing. It's it's not. I wouldn't say it's like all chest. It's a little bit of like a mix, and that's where like you kind of get into like this like really nice, very emotional sounding t like kind of timbre to your voice. And like like guys will rely on that to sing ballads, and they'll sing in that position because it just it sounds much more emotional. But it's like Ange Angelina Jordan is like the master of it, and like that that timbre and above to me had a lot. Of Whitney in it. I just, I, I think that this is a very good pairing for her vocal. If I don't have you, you see no why do the heart of me? You break down my walls with the strength of your love. Mm. She's playing a lot more free with her, her, like how she's pronouncing the, each vowel, and I dig it because I was gonna point out in the beginning how it was very, it was like the do 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 do, like it was, it was so consistent, and like, and I've, I've, 
I've re- I'm going to reference other Angelina Jordan videos that I've done, but like I, I, I personally, my ear struggles naturally to just pair all the, all the like ah sounds or ooh sounds. Cause like, I don't relate it. Like I, I, if I wrote it out, how I would sing it, maybe it would be a little different, but it seems like she has this like natural capacity to find that. And I wouldn't be surprised if it's just cause she likes how it sounds in her embouchure. Cause it's just like, it's so rich and it probably resonates in a lot of her body. Like, like, in my personal experience, there's songs that I sing that just feel good and I like singing them. And there's things that I do in those songs that are different than in other songs that I sing that don't just like resonate, just like at a, like a, just a feeling, you know what I mean? And it seems like she gets that a lot. Like it seems like she's just like in this like intensive emotional like state and, and, and she brings it out and she shows it in a lot of different ways. And like, I'm getting dist- I'm getting distracted. My own points here, man. Let's, let's listen to another part of this. I don't really need to look very much further. I don't want to have. Oh, I was gonna say. So she she was singing it like very 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 like um uh they were they were the same. All the vowels were the same, and they were like placed the same. And like I say, I dig that about Angelina Jordan. And now it seems like she's like playing with it a little more freely and she's kind of having more fun with it. She's letting the runs kind of stand a little taller and like she's, she's stand like she's standing tall. She's in with her chest now. Right. And it's just, I dig, I dig the contrast between the two and it adds to me thinking that this is a good song for her to sing. And I don't know if this is like what this is compared to the original. It doesn't really matter. It sounds great for her voice, how she's doing it. To go where you don't follow. I won't hold it back again. This passion aside, I can't run from myself. I'm gonna take a second before this to talk about this room sound because I've been meaning to talk about this for a while. So when I was when I was mentioning the space, like she masters the space in between her singing because it's like we like if we could, let, let's all be honest here as angels, we would pit, we would listen to Angelina J- Jordan sing a song with no breaks in it because <laughs> she's got one of those voices like I, you just never get tired of it. So it's like that she probably I don't want to say she knows that like because that would sound like too narcissistic, but like to. To give the treat of her voice, you have to respect the time when there's no voice as well, right? But she's giving us these like teases, these big room sounds. It's just like pours her voice in the background. So it's like you don't actually let it go. You don't actually lose it. And it ends exactly when she starts singing again. And it's like that is like there's ways you can manage that. But it's just it's smart, right? Like you could probably have a note, especially when she's hitting these big like crystal clear, just gorgeous carrying out these notes and then like vibrato at the end. Like you could let that ring forever, but you don't need it to because we get her voice back again, right? It's just it's neat. It's neat. The contrast and like like how they play with her voice being like, you know, that that the, the item or like the, the the part, you know what I mean? That we're like, you know, obviously we're here for the video. Video looks great. Angelina Jordan looks great. But like we always come back for her vocal, right? And it's neat to see like what they do with her vocal and with the space without her vocal. I dig it. I'm here for it. If I remember expecting it to be that high and like I could I could hear the key change in my head just wasn't expecting it to be this high it's like how, how how high does Angelina Jordan sing like how high do we actually get because I don't know if I've heard a ton of like of her like performing like this I've heard her sing some high notes before but I don't know if I've heard her perform it like this you know Make me She set that down to the falsetto then? Come Don't on now. You dare, away from me. 
So this is this is where like you start seeing like what mixed voice is, right? So like she's she sounds like she's wailing right now, but she's probably not singing that much louder than she was before. And like and it's different for each singer. Like me, in contrast, I sing really loud all the time. It's just it's bad habits. And and I don't want to say that I don't want to speak for Angelina Jordan and say that she's not, but it's very possible that she's not singing much louder, even though she's singing at like a higher pitch right now and she's using a different register in her voice. But it's I say that it's mixed because she can drop into this really nice like you know kind of head voice kind of falsetto like where it's very gentle but you don't lose a ton of the like the 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 scale of the vocal like it's not it's not buried it's not lost in the mix it still sounds very familiar even though she's changing into another register of her voice and that's why i think it's mixed because you get a bit of your chest voice you get a bit of your head voice it's like this nice kind of middle ground it's just it sounds very uh, like empathetic almost if, if if empathy has a sound that's kind of like what i think it sounds like but that's that's what's going on here she's doing a great job of it We had two vocals there. See, and you hang on, you hang on for so long, right? Because it's like the you. You don't want it to end, right? Of course not. Why would we? Of course you wouldn't want it to end. Uh, let me get rid of this for a second. I thought I thought it was fantastic. Actually, I wanted to pull this up back up for a second because I think there was something at 358 I wanted to go through. Uh, three, let's start at 350. Oh, stay in my if you're there, I must die so, so the, I was going to talk about, <laughs> we're going to get into some shop stuff here. So, uh, I want to, I want to talk about how well they're addressing how, like I think they did whoever was the engineer for the recording I, in my opinion I think they did a fantastic job because of a couple little details one is how hard she comes slapping in and like I don't it's not abrasive but it's like how present it sounds with her voice having that like kind of fry that kind of like that kind of like uh, before the note like obviously more musical than what I'm doing right now but how well they address that and how like like forward it is and then when she goes to the next note it's very gentle to, like it sounds like they had like whatever compressor whatever um dynamic processing they did there they sounded like they did a really good job of it i just wanted to make note of it for a second Right there or must I like how it had like you could hear the fry in her voice that to me sounds like very very good recording for a vocal like this and there's another one that's gonna happen the one right there so when she goes up for the key change and the arc it doesn't like it, it's not abrasive it doesn't hurt and like if you if you imagine like when you've gone to concerts and like that's let's just say like a local concert something like just going on in town maybe four or five hundred people when you have a singer that steps up and all starts, sudden starts singing loud how many times have we all heard it where it comes just wailing over, right? And in a recording, you can manage that, but like you, you kind of expect it a little bit. Like when you see, when you hear her, when you see her being more intense, not 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 like insane or like you know straight like straining, but she's she's like feeling more of it. She's like you know she's probably got to use more energy, more calories almost to like you know let these parts out. It, you you expect something to happen and i think what it is is really good recording management right here and i'm going to point out the part that i'm i'm kind of getting into Else, 
So that I don't wanna whatever the pitch is, but like how that the I does it comes in like that. That to me, I appreciate the hell out of that because it's just like a singer like her. You need stuff like that so that it, you don't miss any of the nuances, right? And then the next one's gonna be really gentle. So let's listen to this this one again. And then the next one when she goes, uh, um, there's like the little space, and then she comes back in with that I don't wanna know another door, whatever the words are. It's just it it rolls over a little more. So like the compressor hits the first one hard, and then it's got a slow time to release so that it's it's a little more gentle on the next one but it's in my opinion it's just like you expect it and they, they captured that very well Same dynamic, a little bit of a different feeling though, right? It doesn't slap like the first one does, right? So that, I, I just wanted to go back and talk about that for a second. Um, but like I dug it, man. I think they did a great job. I think the video looked fantastic. I think Angelina Jordan looks fantastic. I thought it was a great cover, great pairing for her voice, the key changes, everything fantastic, man. Um, I dug it, I dug it. And it's fun, it's fun because even in the recordings, Angelina Jordan gives me something to talk about from a production standpoint. <laughs> Um, and uh, and uh, if, if, you, if you are new to the channel, if you do like this stuff, I did do a video on some like a very top down uh, view of um, stage positions and kind of like some of the jobs of stage stuff. And I'll put the video up here if you want to check that out. Um, I've got one coming in uh, this week about lighting, a little bit more direct with lighting. And I've got a buddy hopefully going to collaborate on that one as well. Um, and I'm excited to be back, man. I'm excited to be back. I got a few more coming up here. Uh, I'll start uploading them. I got to run to the store while they upload and I'll do a few more after that. But it's going to be it's going to be a fun week. Uh, oh, and I appreciate all that, all the happy birthdays too, man. I was overwhelmed once again, overwhelmed once again. But anyways, 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 see everyone again soon.